Hey everyone, this is Candid Anne. Today I want to make a somewhat quick video regarding 4C hair. I know some of you guys don't like that saying because it looks like 4 is a lower grade than number 1 hair and I don't particularly look at it like that. You know, I look at 1 as lacking and adding the numbers means that we're adding more curl. Don't get caught up on that. I think it's just a kind of helpful way to identify like who has a similar hair texture to you and what kind of products work for them. That's all I look at it as, right? So, today's video is going to be about like my 4C hair being curly or not curly. You know, I say that I don't have a curl pattern. I know most of you guys, I've made a video earlier, way many years ago, and I get a lot of comments on that video saying like, what do you mean 4C hair isn't curly? It's the curliest hair pattern, you know? However, I'm, I just finished washing my hair, and I'm gonna show you my hair with no products inside of it, still wet, freshly washed, and you tell me if you see a curl pattern. I'm not sure, I hope this thing focuses. Do you see any curl pattern in there? No, there is no curl pattern. That's just the fact of the matter. And I know one person or maybe quite a few people actually said that if I took a strand of my hair when it was still wet and I put it under a microscope, I'll see that it's really coily. And yes, absolutely, if I took a single strand, you'll see that it is an exact circle from my, like a, like a very small fine point, complete circle. I'd say it's almost like an eight point font in terms of how small it is. But does that necessarily mean that it's curly? The answer is guys, no. When I look at my hair, there's obviously no curl pattern here and that's okay. Sometimes I feel like we get so caught up in saying that our hair isn't kinky or nappy or, or whatever words that you deem derogatory because curly is more acceptable. And my hair isn't curly and I'm okay with that. I don't think it's necessary to call my hair curly simply because if I looked at it at some kind of ridiculous magnification under a microscope, then you would see a curl pattern. You know, like it's just what I'm talking about is when you look at the hair, does it look curly to you? No, mine doesn't. Mine is very kinky. Mine is probably more coily. Mine is nappy. Whatever it is. I accept it. I own it. I'm happy with it. I love it. It's mine and I'm okay with it. I kind of wanted to bring this discussion to the forefront simply because I feel like there's some kind of connotation that curly is okay but kinky isn't or curly is better than nappy or, or you know, I don't know what the case might be but like it's okay. My 4C hair is not curly. Okay, if you look at it, it is not curly. Absolutely, if I look at it under a microscope, sure, it might be. But that's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about just visually looking at it, you know, it's not curly here. All right, so that's pretty much it. I don't want you guys to get hung up on the fact that, you know, one thing is deemed better than the other. Like, I own it. I love it. It's mine. And you can't tell me anything different about it, you know? So I don't really care what words people give to my hair, you know? But I guess for me mostly, people of the black community, women of the natural hair black community, there's this connotation that kind of kind of bothers me a little bit because I don't want anyone to think that curly is okay but kinky isn't and I guess that's the point of this video all right and that's pretty much it you guys love 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 you guys I'm gonna try to do more hair tutorials so take a look out for those and I'll see you guys real soon bye interested in hearing more from me including photography natural hair and other musings check out my blog and these social media platforms links are in the description bar